Hello and welcome to Man of the Ants Plays Planet Coaster Career Mode. So we are into the hard scenarios now. I've just looked and immediately forgotten the name of this. I think it's King Coaster's something something. So King Coaster something something scenario, starting off with the monolith. So a strange object found in the desert appears to have exerted, appears to have exerted an ex unex... Oh my lord. I'm going to start all of that again. <clears throat> Excuse me. A strange object found in the desert appears to have exerted an unexpected effect on the park's rides. Everything keeps breaking down and we're running out of cash. Can't pause it yet. Hire some mechanics, utilize work rosters to fix and maintain the rides, combat the monolith's power and get the park back in profit. Pause the game. Right. So what do we have? We have this is the monolith over here, I'm guessing. Something is uh, giving me that impression. Well, that's nice. More like the floating rock effect. That's cool. We have a few little mini monoliths around as well. I mean, just don't build your park around a monolith, I guess, would uh, be the sensible solution, wouldn't it? So is this the park entrance over here? Yes, it is. That's the park entrance. So what do we have? So that suggests it's a sort of a looped park path. Paths are quite hard to see, aren't they? So probably want to bring those two paths together immediately because that seems a little bit foolish. So we have a cube, a psychola, and that's it by the look of it. Let's take a look at the uh, tracks engine shops. Yes, we have a cube and a psychola, and that is it. We have no shops. We have no facilities. Oh, and what are our objectives? Reach a monthly profit from rides of $2,000 and build four rides. Reach a monthly profit of $4,000 and build a coaster with all of those things. And then reach a monthly profit of $6,000, attract 1,200 guests and pay off all of our loans. How many loans do we have? Well, just the one, but we will drop down those payments to save us a bit of money in the short term. So we have to pay back 49,000. Does that change? Oh, it does change that. Hmm. I still think in the, in, in the meantime, I think it's best just to do that. It's another 500 pound a month in our pocket. So let's stick with that until we start earning a lot of money. So do we have any staff? We have no staff whatsoever. This is, a, this is a weird one, really, isn't it? This is a weird one. So we've got a bunch of paths that aren't connected. That's not connected to that. Those paths aren't connected together. Where does it go from here? That's all fine. That's all fine. That could be connected up. That's a waste of time. It's going towards the monolith there. Is there a path that goes through there? Is that connected? That's connected up by the look of it. So that's fine. And then this path coming over here. I'm not sure how we're going to fit a coaster into this park. Maybe clear out this area and put it over here? There isn't a vast amount of room around really, is there? Okay, well, first things first. Let's hire a janitor. And let's hire a maintenance man. So we'll just unpause it till they get to the ground. Then how do you do rosters and stuff? How does that work? Add a new work roster. Select multiple items. Um... What were these rides called? Can't remember what they're called, Looper and something. So if we stick those two on, we'll just call them the first two. And we'll save that work roster. And we'll stick him on that. So it's now his job just to look after those two rides. That's all he's doing. So I could even build a little path across there by the look of it, couldn't I? Maybe, maybe, okay. So, that's that done. What rides do we have? Insanity, the Psychola, that is the Psychola, isn't it? We have the Psychola. 
That's the cube. And that's the cube. That's the cube. Carousel, Whirly Rig, and Wild Blue. So can the Insanity... The Insanity would fit in there. That would fit in there. That would fit in there. Wild Blue would just about... So I might do Wild Blue, seeing as that's the sort of the bigger one. So let's do that. We'll put the entrance up here. The exit down there. And then we should connect the entrance to a path. What cues have they been using? The A wooden one, but a very pale wooden one that I don't really recognize. Huh. And it must be that one, mustn't it? Oh yes, that looks the same now, doesn't it? So we shall weave this around. And open that up. So I might add that into the roster because those three are quite close together. So where is work roster manager, edit, one, two, three, and we'll call that the first three. We shall chuck down some bins. Uh, it's the standard park bin would be nice. So we'll chuck down some bins around the ride entrances. Or, there we go, yes. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Can't go anywhere there, apparently. That's weird. Well, I guess one... Oh, no. Oh, whoa, whoa. There's a little spot there where it is okay. Where's that gone? There it is. There we go. Two bins. Perfect. And then we should think about doing some shops and the such like as well, which we might be able to squeeze in just here, actually. So let's do that. Shops and facilities. Food shops. Custom. Do blueprint ones bring in more business, I wonder? Well let's go with let's go with one of these. So that's food. We'll stick in a drinks one as well. Like that, perfect. And we could do some toilets. None of those fit perfectly. That's a bit large for a toilet really, isn't it? Am I gonna want this little route here? I might do later on, can I fit it in? Oh, I can fit it in there, so I'll do that. And then I shall add... No, I want to select the toilet. I want to select the toilet. I want to select the... Bloody... Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I'll go into park management, attractions, facilities. Are there... Oh, one's either side. That's no good, is it? Hmm. Definitely want to bring those two together at some point. So let's go back into shops and facilities. So are these one-sided? No, that's double-sided as well. Oh, that's useless. Useless. I mean, that's very nice, but it's a bit over the top. I mean, this is toilets I'm talking about. People are going to use toilets reg regardless, right? So let's just... Pop down some toilets. 
And that's where I was thinking about maybe squeezing a path in, wasn't it? So, ooh, here? We'll pop some toilets in here. Right, there we go. And then I want to edit. How do I edit the toilets? There we go. And we'll charge just 15 cents to start with. Just 15 cents. We shall go into our shops. And we shall change these. We shall stick on all the extras. And we should sync our toilet prices as well, shouldn't we? All the extras, sync the prices. $14 and $10. Select the toilets. Use the same prices there. And then a similar thing here. All the extras. Oops. All the extras. All the extras. Sync the prices. Seven, seven, seven. Cool. Okay. So. Not a bad little start then. So let's actually get things going. Keep it nice and slow for the moment. I wouldn't mind. Where's the nature path? Natural path. This one, I think, is the one we want, isn't it? So let's join these together, which is four meters, and join this side up, and then get rid of these. And the same on this side. Okay. So that's opened up that little area as well, which is nice. We can squeeze a ride in just there by the look of it. And we are going to want to do this area as well at some point. Let's just grab the multi-select and get rid of that. And then we'll stick in our... How big is that path? Is that 8 meters? So there we go. That's that section joined up as well. Perfect. So our maintenance guy should be going to fix these two rides. He should be. Where is he at the moment, I wonder? Let's just pause the game a second. Staff. All staff. Maintenance man. Ah, he's just fixed the uh, that one there. Okay, that's fine. So we could put a path through there. I'm not sure if that's entirely necessary, but it's possible. We could probably maybe fit in a little ride just there, actually. Where else could we fit in some little rides? We might want to save that to see if we can fit the coaster in there, maybe. Same with this bit here. See if we can fit the coaster in there. We need to build four new rides, not just rides. Okay. Can I fit one back there, I wonder? We're going to need to get some research going as well. What's a nice small one? Insanity? That's quite small, isn't it? I might see about doing that then. We pop that in just there. Place the entrance up there and the exit there and then entrance to the path. Nope, nope. Nope. Do 
just there. Okay, that's nice. Let's get that opened up. You've got 100% scenery. You've got 100% scenery. So we should bump your prices up a little bit. You've got 47, I think it was, wasn't it? And you're probably not going to have very much at all. You've got 63. That's not bad. We'll do a little bit extra to those and bump them, get into them, get into the green and then bump the prices up once we've done that. We need to change the work roster for our maintenance guys. So what I might do is put a one guy just doing these two and one guy just doing these two. I think that's what I'm going to do. So this one... It's going to be doing these two and it's going to be called just the cube. And that's already assigned to that guy. Then I'll hire a new maintenance guy. Drop him down there. Can't click on him yet. And this guy is going to do that and that. And I'm going to call that blue. And then I'm going to Click that maintenance guy, and I'm going to say you're going to do blue. Okay, there we go. What are you doing? That ride is working at the moment. So everything's open. Is this open yet? No, that's still broken. So the guy she is just on his way in there now, look. But everything else is up and running. So we built two rides. We need to get a little bit of uh, scenery down around them. Some of these dead trees maybe will uh, work quite well. Yeah, 92. Perfect. So we'll bump that up to $11. And then this one over here, we'll stick down one of those dead looking bushes. Big old tree. Some of those. Little bit of that. Maybe even another tree just there? No? Where can you go? Just there. What are you up to? 70. We could do a little bit more. <laughs> 79. That'll do. 79. So we'll stick that up to $5. Okay, so that's about to be working again. We need to look at getting some more rides. We also need to look at getting some more research on the go. So where are we going to put more rides? That's the first question. We're focusing very much on this size. So we should stick with that for the moment, really. What do we have? We haven't got an insanity. Which might be able to fit in there? No. We've got Psychola, Looper, uh, Cube, sorry. Venetian Carousel. We haven't got one of these. In fact, that's the only thing we haven't got, isn't it? So we do need to get some research on the go very soon. So we want some flat rides, really, don't we? Uh, let's get another thrill ride going. Get that on the go, and then we shall look at building. So we need to build an insanity and a whirly rig somewhere. Where are we going to put those? It's a bit of a confusing layout, this one, isn't it? Oh, there was a space over here, wasn't there? So we could put one there. How big is the insanity? It's about not, not far off the same size, is it? So did, would either of them fit in there? No, not quite. They would probably fit in there if I got rid of that stuff. So I could have one there and one there. Or maybe even one down here? Oh, I could squeeze in one down here. 
Just about somewhere. Oh, not at this angle, apparently. Because I don't think I'm going to want that little bit of space. Because I got that there, but I don't. I think I'll probably have a path coming through there, wouldn't I? But not, not through here. Can't quite get it in there, can I? Oh, well, it goes there, but that's a little bit weird, isn't it? But I'm going to put it there anyway, and we'll see if this works, or whether it's a little bit too cockeyed to work very well. Oh, my headphones are beeping at me, so I need to plug those in to get them charging again. Bear with me for one moment. Oh, hit myself in the face with the headphones. Okay, we are back up and running. Okay, we'll put that over there. Immediately got a 90% scenery rating, which is perfect. So we shall open that up. We shall chuck down a couple of bins. Where are bins? Scenery, what we're doing. Bins, park bins. Bin, bin, bin. Did we put any bins by the shops? I don't think we did, did we? No. Bin, 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 okay. So it's all very popular over here at the moment. Is this working yet? It is working. We should start seeing people going on that soon enough. So we've squeezed a ride in there. We'll have a path coming in here. So we could probably squeeze a ride in here. Is that joined up? No, we need to join those up, don't we? Pause, pause the game. Multi-select, get rid of those, keep the rock. Okay, that's that opened up, that's good. Otherwise, it's a bit of a route for people to get through. You'd have to go all the way up there and down again. So that's that open. So we have a space here, quite a lot of space down here. We have one more ride we can build, which is the insanity. So we'd have to have that in this sort of orientation okay let's put it there so the entrance will go we'll put it right at the back and the exit right there entrance to the path it's not gonna work And this will have a relatively low scenery rating. Oh. Why won't you connect up? Oh, there we go. That's very weird. But okay. Okay, whatever works for you. It's going to have a low scenery rating of exactly nothing. So we will have to do a little bit to this. So let's whack some of these trees around. And then we'll have to hire another maintenance guy to do these as well. A few of these bushes. Some rocks as well. Uh, 
How are we doing? 46, not bad. Some prickly pears. Fit in with the theme, don't they? Squeeze some cacti in. Maybe a big old tree up there. How are we doing? 58. Ooh, need a bit more. Hey! We earned $2,000 from rides last month, which is why that's come through. And obviously we built our four rides as well. So we have hit our first objective. I mean, that's a lot of stuff around there. We're into the greens. So we'll pop in. We'll put that up to $9 now. Okay. So we need to get a maintenance guy over here. So we need to create a new roster for that one and that one. And we should call it, I don't know what either of those rides are called. We should call it West, because it's the West Hand route. So we shall save that. We shall hire another maintenance guy. And he shall be on the West route. So nothing else has broken down yet, but I have been making things go quite slowly, haven't I? But we do seem to be making money just about. Where's our finances? Now, so cube's broken down, but we should have a guy in that relatively soon. So at the moment we're sticking to about two rides per person, but we might just have like one guy doing these four, depending on how quickly we see things break down. And they're going around that route there. How are our, our shops doing in terms of uh, finances? Mm, Chief Beef lost a little bit of money, annoyingly. Why did you lose money? There's a bit of a queue there. What are people saying? I'm thirsty and I need the loo. Well, both of those things are easily sold at very close distances. What about you? I need the loo, refreshing drinks. Well, that's all good. That's all good. So then, I think we are going to leave that there then. I think we're in a pretty good position. We have four rides down. We have three mechanics. We are making money, most importantly. Did I put any bins down down here? I didn't, did I? Ooh. You know I don't like that. You know I like to have my bins. We shall do the bins quickly. Oh, there you go. And we should do some up here as well. Oh, I did some up there. Good, 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 good. We're going to need to think of hiring some security. Yes, people are complaining about security a little bit. So let's hire a security guard and throw him down. I don't think we have any of the... Where would that be? Scenery? Oh, any of... We do have the cameras. Okay, so let's pop down some cameras then. Oh, we've hit one of our silver objectives as well already. So all we need to do now is build the coaster next time and that is sorted. Let's put a camera at the entrance. We'll put a camera by this ride. Do they cost money to run the cameras before I go too crazy? I don't think I ever checked that. Only a dollar. Only a dollar. So that's not too bad, is it? We'll put one up here. One in between these two rides. One here. One up here. Just like that. So we've got cameras. We've got a security guard. Everyone's happy. I might just quickly, whilst we're here... Do a little bit of staff training. So I'm going to give him a $30 rise. Because I know it said to give the... Uh, what are they called? Janitor guys more. I just can't remember how much more. We shall give him 310 We shall give them 170 And 170 310 310 And 170 
Our research is ready to be revealed, so we should do that. We have a new ride to build. We should get another... We should get family ride going is what should we do next. We are just about... Ooh, once a ride breaks down, we start losing money a little bit, don't we? So we'll get a family ride on the go. What was the objective we hit? We hit $4,000 in profit from rides last month. So how are we losing money? Hmm. I think it's just that ride breaking down really, isn't it? I mean, staff wages are already massively up. That's because I hired that security guard, I guess, isn't it? And possibly the extra uh, maintenance guy as well. So we do need to look at getting some more rides up and running very quickly. Very quickly. It is starting to trickle up a little bit. I think if we left it, I think it would start going in the right direction. But it's a bit of a knife edge at the moment, isn't it? Bit of a knife edge. So let's pop a save in. And I will leave that there. Hope you're enjoying. If you are, please do click the like button or subscribe if you'd like to see more in the future. Obviously, both of those things would be very much appreciated. Any questions or comments, just let, uh, leave them down below in the comment section or get hold of me on Twitter or anything like that. And I'll get back to you as soon as I see them. Yeah, a little bit of loss of profit. A bit concerning, but it is going up again now, so not too bad. Otherwise, I shall see you next time in Planet Coaster's career mode. Thank you very much for joining me.